Bradley walks in, passed it through the skates that time of Rydal, and it's Galvis the other way, one on one. Galvis waiting for some help. In front of him was a lousted wide open. Gus with the game on his stick, scores! David Gus, the overtime winner! Hogs 3 to 2 in overtime! Fifth goal of the year for David Gus. And he gives Rockford the extra point here in overtime. 48.8 seconds left in the final frame, and it's Gus with the final say here on the weekend against the Eagles. What a goal from David Gus, set up by Galvis as he crashed right past Olausen and then past the goaltender Eustace on and in. Win the base off shot towards the empty net. It's in. Four to one, Ice Hogs, all the way from the other end of the ice. And it's David Cust with the hat trick. His second in two weeks. And that is the in right circle shoots over the crossbar high. Gutman speeding after it against Harley. Gutman has the puck. He's got Reichel on his wing. Reichel shoots and scores! A Reichel rocket in overtime! It's a 4 3 win for the Ice Hogs. Lucas Reichel with the game winner. Taken across the line by Gutman. And it was Reichel who finished off Texas here tonight. Four to three, the final score. Reichel gets his 14th of the season. The Ice Hogs pick up two points and gain some ground here on Texas in the Central Division standings. Plays, but also got some five on five looks as well. Nicholas Bodin trying to keep up the pressure. They go back door and score! Nicholas Bodin down the right wing goes across the ice and welcome to the Ice Hogs. Luke Philp grabs the first tally of the season for Rockford. 
And the Hogs are on the board, not quite a minute and a half into the third period. Great play by Nicholas Bodine on the backhand, goes back door, far post, and that was an easy slam dunk for Luke Phillips. Lynch, he knocks it free. Lynch finds Lucas Reichel off the left wing circle. Reichel trying to stick handle in the middle of the ice. Lost control. Covering in is David Gus. Gus, wrist shot, scores! Quick release and a great shot from David Gus. Grabs his first as an ice hog, and it is 3-2 with 12.24 to go in the third. Reichel stick handling along the left wing circle. Lost it for a moment. Came to the blue line. Gus caught it right on the line. Walked it down the wing to the top of the circle. And right on the dot. Seized up a shot and goes high glove. That was right off the end. A dozen minutes to go. And we got ourselves a brand new hockey game. And Reichel's going to force a turnover. Lucas Reichel right wing side. Cuts to the middle. Reichel fires and scores! Reichel off the turnover. Barrels down the right side, hits the afterburners at the blue line, carves the path to the top of the crease and tucks it home as Lucas gets it right on top of the red line. And yeah, he's gone, baby. Takes it to the bottom of the right circle and just flips it over top of the catching glove of Arvid Holm. We are tied up at three with 11.59 to go and tack. Here we go, net empty down to my left-hand side. 2.12 to go in the third. Hogs down by a tally. Adam Clendenning, right wing boards, the top of the right circle for Lucas Reichel, deflection, they score! Ice Hogs on a wrist shot from Lucas Reichel, get traffic out in front, and it's going to be Luke Phillips, second of the game, third point for Lucas Reichel this afternoon, 4-4 with 2.04 to go in the third. Reichel right circle, what a redirection by Luke. Just wide of the cage, Hogs keep possession. Seedy, left wing side, looking to go, fires, scores! Seedy, short side, high! Ice Hogs in overtime! Win this one, five to four! What a shot through a tiny window by Brett Seedy. His first as an ice hog. And it's a dandy, the game winner in the extra skates. Skated it around from the far boards to the near side. He goes upstairs over the right. Now Gutman couldn't flag down the rebound after a great chance. Racing up the ice comes Iowa. Patan on the right circle. Now in the high slot, Patan to Rossi. Soderblom with a huge stop. Oh, he robbed him blind. You have to be kidding me. Somebody pinch me right now. Soderblom with an unbelievable save on the former first rounder, Marco Rossi. Sprawling to his left. Holy cow. That's like what you read about. Look at Soderblom with the glove. Call the cops. Highway robbery. Oh, no. Rossi had the game won. And Soderblom said, yeah, you know what? My dinner reservation over to Cini, who taps it up to Galvis across the wing. But now it's given up by Higgins right in front. Galvis trying to jam it in. And the check has the puck once again here for Rockford. Jakob Golf is protecting the disc. He finds Gutman. 18 seconds left in overtime. Right in front. They score! It's Bobby Lynch in overtime! Bobby Lynch with the OT winner. 3-2 the final. And the Hogs sweep the homestand before the All-Star break. It was Gutman right in front to Lynch. It's the fourth goal of the season for Bobby Lynch, and what a goal it was. The Ice Hogs claim victory here at home in front of a sellout crowd. Enjoy the break, fellas. You've earned it. The corner and a centering piece comes back out wide. The left point, Galvis goes D to D for Vlasic. One-timer, Lynch, he scores! A one-time bomb from Bobby Lynch, wide open with a star off out of position, and Rockford is up one night in his first shift here tonight against the Admirals. Vlasic set him up after Galvis held the left point. 
Bobby Lynch with goal number 11 on the season. It has been a record-setting campaign for... And it's played out to Reichel. Up top, Phil shoots and scores! Luke Phil was the one who drew the boarding major, and he blasts this into the back of the net on the power play. Phil with goal number 29 on the season, and it's 2-0 Rockford. 28 left in the first period, and the Hogs are out to a 2-0 lead here against Milwaukee. Kemmel kicked out of the game for the Admirals and given the major. Comes in behind Yaroslav Ascara, who has only lost once to Rockford in regulation this year. David Gust operating on the far circle, tapped in by Sini. It's 3-0. David Gus to Brett Sini, and the Hogs are in total control here in the first. 2.45 left in period one, and Brett Sini has tally number 23 on the season off the setup from David Gus. Gus with a perfect feed across the slot. He has Hilf on the near side, Sini on the back door at the blue line. It's blocked out by Grimaldi. Rocco Grimaldi down the ice. The net is empty, and Grimaldi scores. Rocco Grimaldi punches Rockford's ticket to the postseason with an empty net goal against his old team. You know they say it was tipped. Hot front starts it up ice. Connects with Patan, who went down to the seat, but no call again. Grimaldi steals it at the blue line. Shoots and scores! Rocco Grimaldi, the Grim Reaper of the Central Division, has Rockford game one. Three to two. Rockford strikes first in the series. They win game one in overtime. Shoot, and they score! Buddy Robinson 